This is my one level at a time Ultimate Iron Man, Equilibrium Man, or Equal Man for short. Oh, um, uh, make that Equal Guy for short. The goal of this account is to raise my skill levels while keeping them as equal as possible, no more than one level apart. Exceptions? None! Well, other than hit points. This challenge forces us to go through those weird early level grinds that every other account just skips by going under a waterfall or taking a quiz. Thorough planning would be a huge help to get us started, and hopefully before long, we'd have a streamlined circuit around Gilinor that would take us through each skill, one level at a time. The level 2 circuit is arguably the most difficult, and not just because of my thorough lack of planning. Druidic Ritual is the problem. To keep all skills within one level of each other, besides hit points, I will need to get base 2s before completing Druidic Ritual, which will jump my air blur from 1 to 3, ending the level 2 circuit and starting the level 3 circuit at the same time. The major issue is balancing my combat XP to keep all levels under 3, while getting Slayer level 2, and somehow killing all the animals to get Samfuse meat on the side. But that'd be a problem for later me. The current me was still bright-eyed and bushy-tailed, getting whichever skill I thought of, no thoughts about efficiency or order in mind. After getting my first few levels in Lumbridge, I started Rune Mysteries for the future level 2 runecrafting guide, raked on my way out of the castle, and headed off to start questing. I traded Sedridor my air talisman for a gift box for Aubrey, and headed over to Port Serum for some raking. As an experienced early game quester, I started Pirate's Treasure, no one could give us no XP, and both it and Froon Mysteries will be taking me to Varric. So I might as well do it on the side. I took a quick jaunt to Karamja to play with some bananas, then headed back to Port Serum to snag an apron to snag some rum. I handed that rum in for a key, and stopped on my way to Falador to do the raking content other snowflakes can only dream of. After some AFKing, I'm gonna take poop. I raked some more for two farming, went through Falador to start Juridic Ritual, and got my first Slayer task from Terrail, Birds. After my first of many home tellies, I casted out level 2 magic while getting some rat meat for my guy Sanfu, then started on that Slayer grind, picking up Sanfu's chicken on the way. I also got level 2 strength and defense while on task. At this time, not even halfway to level 2 Slayer and already at 2 in most combat stats, I realized I might be in trouble. I buried some chicken bones for level 2 prayer, fried up some chicken wings for level 2 cooking, and took a break from Slayer while I pondered the issue. Miraculously, I had already almost killed the bear by the time I got level 2 ranged, and I was just barely able to finish it off as I ran out of arrows. Striking the hardest to get meat off of Sanfu's grocery list. I gave Aubrey his gift in exchange for a piece of paper, nipped into the bar to open a chest for another piece of paper, and stopped by Thessalia's to get some fashion scape, which may or may not be useful for future questing. I picked some red berries for that same future quest, and some cadaver berries to do Romeo and Juliet while I was in town. My errands in Varric all run, I home tallied back to Lumbridge to start the next part of the level 2 circuit. If it hasn't struck you yet, um, these levels come slowly. Especially while going out of the way to do a few easy quests on the side. Already I wondered how it might be possible to make an interesting video out of this concept. A troubling thought with me only halfway through the first circuit. No matter though. I helped Ernest not be a chicken on my way to the Wizard's Tower to complete Rune Mysteries. Wanting to be able to turn in Druidic Ritual the next time I went westward, I backtracked to buy some bronze bars from Shantae to get level 2 smithing. Took a break for some fishing time, bought some beef for Samfu, rescued Prince Sally just to feel something, stopped back at the Wizard's Tower for some Rune Essence, which got me level 2 mining and level 2 rune crafting. While in Falador, I killed a gardener to get some booty. And despite being so close to Taverly, with my pockets full of sand-fused meat, I still had several skills to do before I had base twos, so I headed back east. I went to Edgeville so I could teleport over to the other half of Gilinor, where I visited the gnomes to get level two agility, headed all the way down south to get wood, bought some bird traps, and tore my hair out waiting for level two hunter. Ready to finally finish this first circuit around the map, I home tellied for the final time before base 2s, 
being careful with my combat XP, I finished off level 2 Slayer. I stopped by Varrock to buy a house and some nails to go with my planks. I walked all the way over to Remington to build a chair, or two, for level 2 construction. And finally, finally, I headed north, stopping by to dip Sanfu's meat in that stanky sauce he likes. I gave Sanfu his saucy meat and turned in Juridic Ritual, finishing the level 2 circuit. And so started circuit 3, the first repetitions of who knows how many to come. I went back home to use up my planks on level 3 construction, took advantage of my clean inventory to get essence for level 3 mining and level 3 ring crafting. Back in Lumbridge, I rebought my bronze axe for level 3 woodcutting, traded my axe for a tinderbox and set fire to the castle for level 3 fire making, world topped for logs to get level 3 fletching, caught shrimp for level 3 fishing, stole from men for level 3 thieving, Smithed more Cadridium Bronze for level 3 smithing. Spun wool for level 3 crafting. I continued slaying for level 3 attack. Level 11 hit points. Fuck you. Level 3 strength. Level 3 defense. Level 3 prayer. And finish the task. I fried dead birds for level 3 cooking. Got a new task. Raked for level 3 farming. Slayed some more for level 3 magic. Level 3 ranged. And level 3 slayer. I went back to Gnome Town for level 3 agility, and back down south for level 3 hunter, ending the level 3 circuit. Things started feeling easier. I was going to get my next level here, backtrack the circuit, and keep on going forevermore. I got complacent. 4 hunter, 4 fletching, 4 fire making, 4 woodcutting, 4 attack, 4 strength, 4 prayer, 4 defense. 4 ranged, 4 smithing, 4 fishing, 4 cooking, 4 magic, 4 slayer, 4 crafting, 4 thieving, 4 farming, 4 agility, 4 herbalore, 4 mining, 4 rune crafting. So much repetition for such low levels had me desperate for ways to innovate. I used precious mining XP to get enough clay for level 4 construction, a mistake I would soon regret, but that ended the circuit. And so the cycle continued. I mined more clay for 5 mining and 5 construction, and started on 5 root crafting when I realized my error. I didn't have enough mining XP to spare, so I couldn't get enough essence for the rune crafting level. I put the level on hold while I thought of a solution. Thinking fast, I got 5 thieving, 5 woodcutting, 5 fletching, 5 fire making, 5 magic, 12 hit points, 5 range, 5 defense, 5 strength, 5 attack, and 5 slayer, 5 cooking, 5 crafting, 5 smithing, 5 prayer, 5 farming, 5 agility, 5 fishing, and through that leveling I found it. The solution to my worries. I did X marks the spot for an XP lamp, banking the 250 XP in my pocket to jump straight from 4 to 6 rune crafting at the end of the circuit. I finished out 5 herbalore and 5 hunter, and finally, standing in the hunter fields of Piscatoris, my level 5 circuit came to an end, and I was ready to start off my level 6 circuit with a bang. But, well, I think past me put it best. Oh fuck! So that was it. The challenge had been lost. Unless... Meet Equal Guy 2, my one level at a time ultimate Iron Man. No one needs to know what happened to Equal Guy 1, right? Anyway, let's get this fresh and exciting circuit started. Wait a second. Damn it.
meet Equal Guy 3, my one level at a time ultimate Iron Man. No one needs to know what happened to Equal Guy 2, right? Anyway, let's get this fresh and exciting circuit started. Will you shit on my fucking dick? God, I'm stupid. But then, there was one Equilibrium Man to rule them all. Meet Equal Boy. So named because I no longer felt like I deserved to be called a man. This is his journey. And there it was, base 12s. Twice the level of the original equal guy, and with no mistakes the whole way through. I felt accomplished, like I was able to correct my past failures. I logged out for the day, feeling good about myself and looking forward to the way ahead. That was over a year ago. I had gone from playing 10 hours a day to playing 1 hour a day or less at times. I was burnt out. I stopped playing on any account at all. For months, I didn't log into RuneScape. But recently, my passion for RuneScape has hit an all time high. Might we be seeing the return of the Equilibrium Man? What the fuck? Fuck this, I'm making a chunk account. <laughs> <laughs> 